What's going on, everybody? So I want to talk about the fastest way to level. It's not necessarily the best way to get loot um, or anything like that. It is just the fastest way to level. And you can see here I've maxed out two characters. I have two more halfway maxed out. Uh, and the maxed out characters took me about an hour hour and a half uh the two halfway max that i've only been playing for about 30 45 minutes at least doing the methods that i wanted to um i've spent a little bit more time doing some dungeons but that's for another conversation this is not resetting events it's not resetting dungeons it's not farming the strongholds which are all good ways they're not bad ways they're good ways and especially to get like ovals to help you gamble or to obviously get some renown going or you know getting some legendaries going with the stronghold farming all of that stuff is good okay but we're talking about strictly just xp here and this method is uh, a little bit rng because you have to not have people in the area uh, that just recently got through the area but we're going in that bottom right hand spot, but we're not going towards the event necessarily. You can do the event in this route if you wish, um, which will give you loot. It will give you some other things, um, but it's not necessarily the best XP. It's just going to help you get some other value for your account. So we're going to head back to town here and then I'm going to teleport over to the area I'm talking about uh, and we're going to get some XP. Now, it's important to note that the more mobility you have in your build, the faster this will be. When I was trying this on my Rogue, I was able to make a full circuit in about two and a half, three minutes, whereas someone like the Necromancer takes about um, five minutes. So we're going down here and we're gonna basically circle in this area. We're gonna start off with the town um, and we're gonna head west, head straight down and then circle around this lake, head back up. And then we're gonna go through this dungeon over here Head to the event. If the event's up, you can complete it. We're gonna kill some monsters over here. If you don't wanna do the event, you just head south, kill this pack. You can head back around um, and then you can kill some monsters over here. And then you just log out, log back in and make the same route over and over again. So let's teleport over there and just show you what I'm talking about. It's pretty impressive how quickly you get XP. Each circuit takes about, again, five minutes for the Necromancer, um, potentially two and a half to three minutes on the Rogue. If you are doing the full circuit, you can get potentially about 60 to 70% of a level each circuit, um, which is huge, huge XP. And this isn't even with experience boosts. If you get experience boosts, you're gonna get even faster XP, uh, which is absolutely amazing. So let's head over there and just show you what I mean. So we're gonna head directly west and we're gonna head directly south. So immediately you can see ghoul pack, kill it, right? Kill off the entire ghoul pack, um, that's gonna be Kind of what we're doing. We're just killing ghoul packs. Boom, you head south, another ghoul pack, right? And if you look at my XP bar, right, you get roughly about half an individual bar from each of these packs, uh, which is really, really nice. And we're gonna kill off the pack. Boom, look at that, another half XP bar. Keep on going. Boom, another pack, kill off this one. Very, very simple, simplistic stuff, guys. We just kill off the ghouls. Um, we don't care about anything else. Another ghoul pack up here. This has such high mob density with all the ghouls, um, and it is just absolutely absurd. So killing off more ghouls, head up north, more ghouls. <laughs> it's, it's pretty simple. Uh, there's not really much thinking to this one. Head around the edge here. Nice big pack over here. Boom, kill off all these guys, and we're about to get a level already, <laughs> just doing this method. Um, Boom, kill off another pack here. This one's skeletons. I like to go up here just to take care of a couple of these skeletons and then you head back down. Obviously, the faster that you kill stuff, the even better. Necro is really good for that because of the high damage. But again, the moment, more mobility that you have, um, the even, even better. And in fact, it actually looks like it takes far less than five minutes per circuit here. Um, that was just an estimation I made earlier on when I was doing a rough recording. But as I'm running around here, I've spent about two minutes talking to you on the video and we're already almost through the entire circuit. So there's the last ghoul pack and I believe there is a, another one down here. Um, so it's not quite the last ghoul pack. And then we go directly east, pick up some ghouls over here. So I guess I was a little bit off. I, I, I didn't see a ghoul pack earlier um, there and it must've been because someone killed it. And that is a consideration, right? Uh, is that you will find people that are killing off the ghoul packs sometimes, um, which is a little unfortunate, but look at that. We got 30% or 40% of our initial level. And then we also got uh, about 30% into our new level, which is absolutely absurd XP. And if you go back around, you'll notice that the monsters are still dead, which forces you to log out, log back in, and then run that same 
location. So this is the fastest way to level. It's absolutely absurd. I spent two and a half minutes, three minutes actually um, on this video talking about it. Um, and with the Rogue, it took me two and a half, three minutes. However, as I've been getting better at it, the time has been speeding up. So you might um, go, and go through and, okay, where's the ghouls? Where's the ghouls here? Um, and even at the end there, I'm still not quite familiar with it. I've only ran this um, about four or five times on different characters. And so when you start getting familiar with it, you just run through it and just absolutely blast some XP. So really, really nice way, guys, and the best way to farm XP only. You're just farming trash mobs. So you're not going to get any obols or gear or anything. It's just XP. So keep that in mind. Thanks for watching. See you all tomorrow.